in science. In this video, let's find the greatest common factor of 24 and 40. And I like to find the greatest common factor using a factor tree. I just think it's easy. We have 2 times 12 equals 24. Circle the 2 because it is prime. Now 2 times 6 equals 12. Circle the 2 again because it is prime. And then 2 times 3. I'll circle both of these because they're prime. And I'm now down to prime numbers. Now we have 40. So let's begin with 40. Let's just go 2 times 20. We'll eventually get there. And circle the 2 because it is prime. And then 2 times 10 equals 20. Circle the 2. And then 2 times 5. Circle both of them because they're prime. And now we're down to the prime numbers. I mean two prime numbers, so we're finished. Now I'm going to complete a factor chart to help cut down the number of errors. And I'll follow one simple rule. I'll write down the prime numbers. There's the prime numbers of 24, 2, 2, and 3. And then the prime numbers of 40 are 2, 2, 2. I do not have a 3, so I'm going to skip over and write the 5 there. So now the rule is for finding the greatest common factor, let me move this up just a hair, is this. How about that? Is that you have to, since we're finding the prime number of two numbers, you have to have pairs. So we have a pair of 2's, so I'll write a 2, a pair of 2's pair of twos. I do not have a three, so I'm not going to use that, nor a five. So now I just multiply the twos together. Two times two is four. Four times two equals eight. So the prime number of 24 and 40 is eight. Thanks for watching, and Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.